Our reporters have fanned out across Butte and Tehama counties this morning to show you what's happening with the fire as you wake up. First, we begin with Diego Moctezuma. He's posted himself along Highway 32 between Chico and Forest Ranch. And Diego, in the last hour, has the fire activity changed since you arrived there? Kelly, it's actually interesting. What I've noticed is all the smoke, you know, to the north side of the highway here that you're seeing a large plume of smoke and I'm kind of seeing it go towards the west of me. It's all traveling this way towards the west of me. Now again, um, most of that flames and stuff that was very close to me are kind of gone now, but you can see it from a distance right over here as I'm going to step out and kind of give you a better look, but you can see a large ray of smoke going towards the west of me again, like I said. But um, look at those flames right there, just about uh, a mile or so out. And uh, you can see fire crews out over here uh, just monitoring, uh, making sure it doesn't cross over to the uh, east side of the highway here. And again, I don't think that's going to be a problem. It does look very close, as you can see, as that smoke builds up very close to the highway. But again, it looks like it's traveling uh, towards to the west of me um, now. Again, uh, this is to the north of the highway, and I'm about another six miles or so from getting into Forest Ranch. So about a halfway mark from Chico to Forest Ranch. Now, Cal Fire tells me that um, they're here patrolling, making sure it doesn't go over this highway. And I don't think that's going to be a problem right now as it's traveling that way. Live in Butte County, I'm Diego Moctezuma with Action News Now. Yeah, thanks, Diego. And a reminder, Highway 32 is closed to the public because of that area being under an evacuation warning in the Forest Ranch area.